assalamu alaikum welcome to nasir sob this is the interview questions and answers series for php jobs and in this video we will talk about the different sql join a join class is used to combine rows from two or more tables based on a related column between them in sql a join class is used to return a table that merges the contents of two or more other tables together for example if we have two table one containing information on customer and another containing information on the orders various that various customer have placed so this is the order table for example it has an, some order id customer id and order date and the customer detail table that is customers table and inside this one there is a customer id customer name content name country if we see the customer id in order table is also mentioned in the customer id in the customer uh, table so basically it tells us which customers have placed order and the order date is this one so if we join both tables to check which customer place the order so we will use the join so join is used to merge two or more tables in this scenario the customer on the base of the customer id we will make join so for example here is the select we select the from the orders order id from the customer customer name and orders order date from orders table and inner joint keyword is used and we place join on the customers table on the basis of both customer id so we see that on the basis of customer id on both table if both customer on uh, id matches then returns the data so on the basis of customer id we merge both table together so if the match customer id placed then the records will return otherwise the null return okay we will see it in more detail later different types of sql joins there are multiple types of sql join first we will talk about the inner joint inner joint returns records that have matching values in both table if no matching occur then empty record will come as a result okay so this is inner joint for example we joined from the two table that is for first table is table 1 and second table is table 2 then inner join just returns the common between both tables okay the matching rows on the base of a condition between both tables it is same as the intersection in mathematics okay and the query is this one inner joint second table for example table 1 is orders and table 2 is customer and the condition is after own keyword then orders customer id and customers table customer id if both matches then uh, give us the order id customer name and order date let's see this query practically in my, mysql php my admin uh, this is um, my sql local host and this is sql yog just a client for the php my admin and we have first table that is customers and inside the customer you will see that the customer id customer name customer uh, content name address and many more and another table that is orders and inside the order there is order id customer id employer id order date and so on okay so we write the query that is i paste the query select from the orders table order id and from the customers table customer name from orders where inner joint or we can use just join as an inner joint okay customer stable and the condition is where both customer id matches 
so before execute uh, this query so first if i go to the customers table and you will see that the customer id is one two and three and if i go to the orders table then the in uh, inside the orders table inside the customer id column there is only two okay that occur inside the customers id column and this these 37 and 77 not occur so if i execute this query then only one matching row uh, will be returned basically it also uh, contain that one id that is only two that occur inside the customers id table so if i execute this query then you will see that only one row is written basically one matching row will return and one record match okay so this is the inner joint the inner joint just returned the matching rows between the two tables hope you will understand now we will move toward the next sql joint left joint returns all records from the left table and the match record from the right table if a row in the left table does not contain a corresponding match in the right table it will still be listed with null values in columns for for the right table so we use the left joint in a scenario when we want some records even if not match a match occur okay then if not match occur then the null values return but showing the record okay of the left side uh, left of the joint okay so this is the left joint and it returns as the match records and even not match occur then the left side okay left side of the joint table and its uh, query is very simple for example if we write the query from the customers table okay and left joint from orders and we want the left side customers tables these the customer name must become even not match occur okay on customer id this condition is customer both customer id matches from both table and order by customer name let's see it practically this is very simple uh, you will see this query before that is inner joint and if i replace the inner with the left word okay now you will see that first only match rows will come and now if i execute this uh, query then it returns me the order id and the customer name even with the null rows with the null record okay from the uh, if not match occurred if i execute this query then you will see that if match occurred then it shows me the customer name and if not match occurred then it returns the customer name with null okay and returns the order id basically orders has left joint so it returns us the orders table column that is order id which we select and if not match occur then the uh, null uh, will come okay so hope you understand the concept of left joint now let's move toward the next sql clause next type is right joint it is simple as the left joint and here we just want if not match occur then write uh, table uh, return with match rows if not with null values okay so the right join keyword returns all record from the right table and the match record from the left table the result is null from the left side when there is no match so the right joint is this one just like the right table and the uh, match rows between both of this table okay and the query is very simple simple that in the word that is used right joint okay and, and we want the right table even if not in the, uh, this condition is not occur for example this condition is not match then even return as the right table okay so this is very simple if i again go to the uh, query and this is my uh, sql log and here you see that 
first of the left joint it shows us the left table that is orders and order id even return not match occur and the right side is null and if i replace the left keyword with right then you will see that now we want the right table result will come even with no match occur so the right table is customers now if i execute this query the customer name return and the left side will be null even no match occur basically these two rows no match occur inside these two rows and the match occur on the base of this condition inside this uh, call uh, sorry row okay if i execute this query then you will see that the right table customers record will come and the left side will null basically these no if no match occurs okay and in this query the uh, no match occur between these two rows if i execute this query and you will see that the first match occur then it returns both data and from the last two rows it returns me the customer name of the right side okay and no match occur so it null value is come of the left side so hope you will understand the next sql joint is full join the full join or something like full outer join keywords return all records from there is a match in left or right table okay full join or full outer join keyword are same and the full join return us the whole data that is table 1 table 2 and here match rows okay and the very simple uh, sql query that is select this one from customers and full outer join or full join orders orders table and on the base of this condition order by customer name okay so if we write this query in our board table then it shows us the old data all data okay this type of sql join is cross join it returns the cartesian product of two table in other words each individual row of the left table matches with the each individual row of the right table for example this row in table one there are three rows one two three and in table two also three rows and you see that the one row is match to the all rows of the table two and same the first second row of the table one will match the all rows from the table two and with the same ratio table three third row will match with the all first second and third row of the table two and its query is very simple from the table one cross join table two if i go to the my db that php my admin and here i write the select static from the table one that is for example customers and then the cross join of the table 2 that is orders okay and i run the query and you will see that the all tables sorry all rows from the customer table will match one by one from the orders okay the alfredo this is alfredo this is alfredo and this is alfredo basically three rows of the orders table so the each row from the customer table will match the each row of the orders table okay so this is very simple now move toward the next type of the sql joint the next type is self joint a self joint is a regular joint but the table is joined with itself select column name from the table and then the alias of the table one for example t1 and t2 where condition okay so t1 and t2 are different table alias of table one so in such, uh, such scenario we just perform the self joint and the copy uh, and uh, of the alias of the table for example there are two copies of the table one t1 and t2 and on we can play on t1 t2 okay and on the basis of our scenario so this is called the self joint if i talk about the query the query is very simple for example 
here the customers table have two aliases a and b so customer table have two copies a and b and from the table a that is the alias of customers v uh, that is customer name that is customer as customer name one and b customer name is customer name two and a city from the customers and then aliases where the condition is a dot customer id is not equal to b dot customer id it based on our scenario and the second condition is a dot city is equal to the b alias of still that table city and order by this one so hope guys you will understand the concept of self join so these all are the different type of uh, the joints and one last thing that is not related to this topic that is related to our daily life the quote of the day that is it does not matter how slowly you go as long as you do not stop thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay blessed have a nice day